standing by for us in La Palma this uh, this morning. Pretty dramatic pictures again. That lava moving down the hillside there. Uh, Becky, what's happening? Yeah, it's really quite striking this morning, Bekay. There is this giant fountain of lava coming out of the volcano a little bit further down. It looks like it's several hundred feet high. And one thing we've noticed in the last hour as the sun has risen is just how much thick black smoke there is coming out of the top of the volcano and collecting overhead. Now, as you mentioned, uh, the big concern now is if and when this lava is going to hit the sea. It's a very steep slope down from the top of the volcano to the coast. When we last heard, the lava was about 800 metres away. And the fear is that if and when it hits the sea, it will create a thermal shock that will release toxic vapours that contain hydrochloric acid. That is dangerous to breathe in and it irritates the eyes and the skin. And that is why the local government here has told residents in those neighbourhoods surrounding the coast to stay inside. Obviously, for the, the fear for them is the gas, but the fear for others is the lava itself. We know that it's already just already destroyed over 500 homes here, and the government has said that they are going to put 5 million uh, towards new homes, but that will only cover a fraction of those people. The costs really will run into the tens of millions, if not more. Okay, Becky, thank you. Uh, big day today. Um